So this is a multiple choice question. Make sure that you do actually answer the question before you look at the answers and try and eliminate those distractors. So this is one where it's probably worth just memorizing um, a set of situations. Diverging lens is used to produce an object, an image of a real object, an image, a real object. How, how the row of the table correctly identifies the nature of the image produced. So I would just to say, uh, memorize that. What's the rules for diverging? What's the rules for converging? If they're in front of or before the um, focal length or otherwise. <clears throat> but you could remember and learn it so well that you could figure it out in an exam. So if this was the axis of the lens, this is the object here, um, lens in the middle, and you're told it's a diverging lens, which has this symbol. Okay, what's going to happen to this ray as it meets the lens? It's going to move away from that. Um, and a ray from the top straight through the center of the lens. Remembering where do these rays cross? That's where the image is produced. Well, they're not going to cross because it's a diverging lens. But if I project that one backwards, that means I'm going to get a virtual image where they cross is virtual because it's an imaginary ray and where they cross um, the top of the image is. So it's virtual, because it's imaginary, and it is upright. So this answer is C. So I hope that was really useful to you. Exam questions are a great way to practice for exams, but don't just do exam questions. There's, if you struggle with that exam question, then you probably need to revisit the theory for that topic. So do that before you have a go at some other ones. If I've made any mistakes, then correct them down below. And if you've got any more questions, then down below as well. Maybe you guys can help each other out. And there should be some um, playlists around here and a subscribe button if you like that and you want to see some more as and when I bring it out. All right, thanks a lot for watching.